Right now at 530, the race is now on to fill the only vacant seat on the Atlanta City Council. Two women with years of experience are vying for the post three at large seat and they will face off in a runoff on December 3rd. 11 Alive's Joe Ripley spoke with both candidates about how they plan to turn voters back out in just three short weeks. You've probably seen the signs all around Atlanta. Two faces that have become familiar this election season. Voters will soon elect a new member to fill Atlanta City Council's post three at large seat vacated by Keisha Waits in March. The race is headed to a runoff after no candidate received more than 50% of the vote on November 5th. Dr. Nicole Jones spent 30 years as a counselor and principal in Atlanta public schools. Jones says her agenda involves putting neighborhoods first by focusing on safety, housing, and transportation. As a first time candidate, you don't really know what to expect. If you put in the time and the hard work and you try to connect with as many people as possible, your hope is that it will resonate and that people will turn out for you. Her opponent, Ishe Collins, is an Atlanta native and civil rights attorney. She currently sits on the Atlanta Board of Education. Collins touts record graduation rates in APS and working to provide affordable housing for educators. More than 77,000 people cast ballots in the general election. Turnout for the runoff could be a fraction of that number, ensuring that every vote will matter. Continue to fight for a city that thrives for all of us, being very clear that no matter where you live in the city, no matter your income and no matter your family, structure, we all should be able to take advantage of the things that make Atlanta great. In Atlanta, Joe Ripley, 11 Alive News. All right, so early voting starts Saturday, November 23rd. That runoff is set for Tuesday, December 3rd.